student now we want to study the method to derive the formula for area of triangle given a triangle ABC with two lengths of side and included angle unknown two lengths of sides and one included angle given as you can see area of triangle ABC can be written as half A B sine C or you can use half A C sine B or you can use half B C sine A and as you can observe there should be A B C there either A B the two side and the C is the angle or A C as the two sides and sine B angle B so it's still A B C and it can be written as half B C sine A still you can see this A B C so many A B C so it shows that it's very creative right how to find the area of triangle how to prove it okay let's see Suppose the length of side A and B, the length of side A and B, as well as included angle C are given. That means the A, let's say, is 10, the B is 20 cm, and the angle C maybe is 40. Alright, if there is a case, we can find the height, right? How to find the height of the triangle? Later we will discuss. But as we know, area of triangle ABC is 1 over 2 base times with the height. So the base is actually the length of AC which is B. And the height is actually the H. So let's say H over A. H is the opposite to C over the A which is the hypotenuse is equal to sine C hence H is equal to A sine C so area of triangle ABC is 1 over 2 times B times H right so then if we substitute H equal to A sine C then we will get area of triangle is 1 over 2 A times B times sine C right so find the height first if this is the case h over a is sine c let's say the c is there then h is equal to a sine c all right so the area of triangle can be written as half a b sine c by similar method it can be proved that area of triangle a b c is 1 over 2 a c sine b is also equal to 1 over 2 BC sine A. That's all my sharing about how to prove the area of triangle.